And in a pretty bold move, North College Hills School Board has given the green light to a new blended learning model that will keep kids home one day a week while educators map out what to teach. You see it in their eyes, you know, you see it in their spirit. They're just tired and they're overwhelmed. North College Hill City School Superintendent Eugene Blaylock isn't talking about stressed out students. Instead, his focus is on educators. For our district, we struggle with hiring uh, and retaining teachers. Also, uh, it's tough to get substitute teachers. As a result, Blaylock says his district will take a big step outside the normal classroom setting next fall. I think it's going to be a game changer. Instead of spending five days a week in a classroom, students will stay home on Mondays and do schoolwork based on what they're learning. Their teachers will still report for duty, but will use the time away from their students to create lesson plans. For educators, the planning is probably the most difficult piece. The presenting and direct instruction, that's the easy piece, to be perfectly honest with you. But if you don't have the opportunity to properly plan for your students, then you struggle because you're not prepared. So Mondays is opportunity to do collaboration, to do planning, to use data. Blaylock, who says the five day blended learning model is based on guidance from the state's Department of Education, is excited to see how things unfold. This is my hypothesis. If teachers are well rested and uh, if they're well rested, mentally, mentally ready to go and they are present in the classroom, that student achievement will go up. So I think this will uh, reignite uh, that fire in our teachers and they'll come in here and teach like their hair is on fire. Now, of course, a big question in all of this is about child care. Uh, Blaylock says kindergarten students through eighth graders will have the option of going to their school buildings next fall and doing those assignments that they are uh, scheduled to do under the watchful eye of a supervised staff member. It won't be a teacher again. They'll be doing the lesson plans, but another school official keep an eye on them. And he says students will have access to the school meals that they'll be missing by staying home. For now, reporting live in North College Hill, Todd Dykes, WWT News.